Ladies and gentlemen, there is a new species of human ancestor. Professor Lee Berger, an American paleoanthropologist at Wits University, named him Australopithecus sediba. And the most astonishing thing about him is his skull, 1.9 million years old, so well preserved that you can count his teeth, so very much like ours. Where did he live? In these hills just 50 minutes from Johannesburg, in what is called the Cradle of Humankind. Here's the site. There are bones here. Let's look around. Matthew got up, ran over in that direction. A minute and a half later, he called me. Matthew found something which he knew would excite his father. Here's a rock that looks about the same size. And when I turned it over, there was a fossil. I looked at that fossil in that rock and knew exactly what he found. He had found a clavicle, a collarbone. A hundred years ago, miners blasted these caves and scattered rocks and fossils all over the place. Fossils, including a skull. You found it? Right here. It was lying on its side, uh, sticking out of the wall in this area. Its body's, in fact, all the way up there. Its foot is still in the rock, just up at the top there. 